Meet Mike. Mike is 24. He is currently single but has a vast social network. He earns 22,000 a year and rents his apartment. As a recruitment professional, Mike is constantly traveling and relies heavily on his smartphone to stay connected. Lately, however, Mike has noticed a large number of dropped calls and lack of network availability around one particular train station and he's been tweeting about it. He had recently received an email from Asterette about some sort of network issue but hadn't gone around to opening it. Now that he was considering switching carriers, maybe that email would provide him a link to the company website so he could find information on getting the portability code to transfer his number to another network. When Mike got to his office, he quickly found the email from Asterect and clicked through to the company website. Upon arrival, he immediately noticed a banner talking about network update plans. Having an option to chat with an agent, that seemed like a great place to start. As soon as the chat session started, Mike got straight to the point. I've had a lot of drop calls recently and I would like to transfer my number. Typically, these types of interactions don't go well, but this agent was ready. Sensing Mike's frustration, the agent was able to quickly recalculate the best possible offer for Mike based on the latest information. In addition to letting Mike know that network updates were scheduled that would directly impact his issue, the agent was able to extend the most relevant retention offer to make sure that Mike was satisfied. His issue resolved, Mike even went so far as to tweet about it to his avid followers on social media. Talk about pulling victory from the jaws of defeat. That was awesome. But there was obviously a lot going on in the background. How did Asterret manage Mike's entire customer journey like that? Let's take a look. In the background, there were a lot of complex events being processed to marry operational analytics with customer insight to initiate strategic customer interactions. Some of that customer insight comes from new sources and types of social data. When this breadth of operational data and customer insight is available across the analytical ecosystem, multi-genre analytical routines can be tied together to make customer satisfaction calculations even more precise and accurate. When Mike was identified on the website, operational insight and customer satisfaction insight quickly merged in the form of a highly personalized homepage experience for Mike. As real-time information was captured, the chat agent was able to recalculate or arbitrate the multiple offers that would be best for Mike. Lastly, Asterette was able to choreograph a seamless experience for Mike across all of their customer interaction channels. Many companies struggle with this vision of the customer journey. There seems to be so many moving parts. It requires an analytical architecture for consuming new sources of customer data and insight. It requires an approach for applying multi-genre analytical routines to these expanded data sources to unlock the customer insight hidden within. Lastly, it requires a mechanism for operationalizing these insights through choreographed and coordinated enterprise interactions. Many businesses struggle with this. You can ensure a consistent customer experience with a customer journey from Teradata.